Digital scent technology is the engineering discipline dealing with olfactory representation. It is a technology to sense, transmit and receive scent-enabled digital media. This sensing part of this technology works by using olfactometers and electronic noses. History In the late 1950s, a Hans Lauber invented the smell-o-vision, a system which released odor during the projection of a film so that the viewer could smell what was happening in the movie. The smell-o-vision faced competition with the Roma Armor, a similar system invented by Charles Weiss that emitted scents through the air conditioning system of a theater. Variety dubbed the competition, the Battle of the Smellies. Smell-o-vision did not work as intended. According to a Variety review of the mystery comedy film Scent of Mystery, which featured the one and only use of smell-o-vision, aromas were released with a distracting hissing noise and audience members in the balcony complained that the scents reached them several seconds after the action was shown on the screen. In other parts of the theater, the odors were too faint, causing audience members to sniff loudly in an attempt to catch the scent. These technical problems were mostly corrected after the first few showings, but the poor word of mouth, in conjunction with generally negative reviews of the film itself, led to the decline of smell-o-vision. In 1999, Digisense developed a computer peripheral device called Ismel, which was designed to emit a smell when a user visited a website or opened an email. The device contained a cartridge with 128 primary odors, which could be mixed to replicate natural and man-made odors. Digisense had indexed thousands of common odors, which could be coded, digitized, and embedded into web pages or email. After $20 million in investment, Digisense was shut down in 2001 when it was unable to obtain the additional funding it required. In 2000, Aromajet developed a scent-generating device prototype called Pinoak. No new announcements have been made since December 2000. In 2003, Trisenx launched a scent-generating device called Scent Dome, which by 2004 was tested by the UK internet service provider TeleWest. This device was about the size of a teapot and could generate up to 60 different smells by releasing particles from one or more of 20 liquid-filled odor capsules. Computers fitted with a scent dome unit used software to recognize smell identifying codes embedded in an email or web page. In 2004, Suji Wellness and France Telecom developed a scent generating device called Kauri Web, which comes with six different cartridges for different smells. The Japanese firm, K-Opticom, had placed special units of this device in their internet cafes and other venues until the end of the experiment, March 20, 2005. Also in 2004, the Indian inventor Sandeep Gupta founded Sav Products, LLC and claimed to show a scent-generating device prototype at SAY 2005. However, the device was not seen there. In 2005, researchers from the University of Huelva developed XML Smell, a protocol of XML that can transmit smells. The researchers also developed a scent-generating device and worked on miniaturizing its size. Also in 2005, Thanko launched P at D Aroma Generator, a USB device that comes with three different cartridges for different smells. Today, many companies are working on this technology, such as Scentcom. In 2005, Japanese researchers announced that they are working on a 3D television with touch and smell that would be commercially available on the market by the year 2020. In June 2011, a press release from the University of California San Diego Jacobs School of Engineering announced a paper published in Anjuantakami describing an optimization and mini tacturization of a component that can select and release scents from 10,000 odors. That is intended to be part of a digital scent solution for TVs and phones. In March 2013, a group of Japanese researchers unveiled a prototype invention they dubbed a smelling screen. The device combines a digital display with four small fans that direct an emitted odor to a specific spot on the screen. The fans operate at a very low speed. 
making it difficult for the user to perceive airflow. Instead he or each perceives the smell as coming directly out of the screen an object displayed at that location.